Yeah, that, um, that felt like a, a synchronicity because when Mary approached me to play it, she was inspired by, of all people, Rose from Dogfight, if you can believe it. That's how she saw Valerie, don't ask me how. <laughs> but what was, what was interesting was, I was like, she said, Valerie Solano's, I said, oh my God, yeah, I said, the, the Scum Manifesto, I found that in City Life Bookstore. Oh my God, maybe when I was doing the dogfight, that's even weird, I didn't realize that. But, you know, it was, I remember passing it in the bookstore and I just, the, the, her face, that was, that was the cover, was Valerie's face and it just caught my eye. Her look, I, her look was so arresting. And I bought it, and it's not like everybody has that book, you know what I mean? And especially back then, and, and I was like, yeah, that Valerie Sloan has got a manifesto. And so then from there we started, and she had like seven years of research, boxes of research. And Valerie's only mentioned two books, uh, Daring to be Bad and Female Perversity. And so it really felt like, um, uh, investigate, it felt like a mystery, an investigation, an exploration, a creation. And um, yeah, maybe two months preparation. And so for me, it, it was one of the more fulfilling creative processes I'd had because of the preparation and because of the relationship with Mary. And it being right when the independents were at that, well, right when they sort of ended too, but it was also right at the apex where it was like Christine Vachon was just bulldozing through New York and just like, I want the permit, you know, I don't care. You know, just, well, shoot it for this. And it was just like really inspiring. And uh, so that, those are my thoughts and feelings about that one. I've had a lot of really great experiences because, and I will name a few, but because I think early on I got that so much can happen in movies that, that um, is out of my control, that just so much is out of my control that, that if I can have a good relationship with the director, then like I've won in a way no matter what, if the movie never comes out, if some of the aspects aren't great, if I don't get to where I'd like to acting wise, whatever, at least I've had a good experience with the director. I got that early on, so as a result, I've had a lot of really good experiences. Um, I loved working with Amir Kusturisa. I mean, that was a whole other experience, Arizona Dream, I don't know it wasn't released here, um, or I think you can get it at Blockbuster. Uh, yeah, I'm sure you can get it on video, but has anybody seen Arizona Dream here? Uh, uh, all right, get thee to a video store. <laughs> it's the guy who did Time of the Gypsies and When Father Was Away on Business from former Yugoslavia, and really, really magnificent director. Um, the stuff that I worked with Mary on, uh, uh, Girls Town was a really great experience. I, I loved working with Abel on the addiction. It was hard, but I loved it too. Um, I, I, yeah, because, because the director's been the most important thing, I've en ended up having great experiences. Even if the part wasn't great or whatever, at least I've had an education or had a, a great experience with the crew and, you know. So those are a few.